I'm Pedro and I'm the lead product manager at Plux. Today I want to help you to choose the right Biosignals Plux hub for your research project. When selecting a hub, we frequently encounter the same question. Should I use a 4-channel hub or should I upgrade to an 8-channel hub? Usually the number of sensors you'd like to use already gives you a hint on what hub to choose. However, there's a little bit more to it, so let's have a look. The 4-channel Biosignals Plux Hub comes with four analog sensor inputs, to which you can connect any of the analog Biosignals Plux sensors. In addition, it has a common reference port, to which you can connect a shared reference electrode when using multiple sensors of the same type, such as for example using multiple electromyography sensors. The 8-channel Biosignals Plux Hub comes with eight analog sensor inputs. It also comes with a shared reference electrode port and with an additional digital input and output port for accessories. For example, when using trigger buttons, foot switches, LEDs or synchronization accessories for, to synchronize the Biosignals Plugs Hub with third-party solutions. When choosing the right hub for you, you essentially have to ask yourself the following questions. How many sensors do you want to use? Would you like to have more than four sensors? And would you like to use accessories and synchronization tools with your Biosignals Plugs Hub? The four-channel Biosignals Plugs Hub is the ideal starter kit for when you want to use four or less sensors. However, if you want to use more sensors, or if you would like to have the, avail the, the availability to add further sensors in the future, or synchronize your Biosignals Plugs with third-party solutions, then the eight-channel hub is the right choice for you. And that's it. I'm sure there's the right Biosignals Plugs Hub for your research project. For, for more information, visit plugsbiosignals.com and our support pages. Thank you for watching.